on this episode of Wild Tatoes, we see him in his natural habitat, trotting through someone else's yard. Because you can't control Tato. No one can. He does what he wants. Tato! Come here, boy! Clear across all the property towards the neighbors. Hundreds of yards away. This Tato has no respect for anyone or anything. And I sneezed. It phases him not at all. Come here, Tato. Good boy. We venture yet closer and closer. As he trots away like he's doing nothing wrong at all. Ignoring every command. What a dick. I'm running out of words that I can say with this terrible Australian accent. Come on, Tato boy. I've never even met these neighbors. I have no idea who they are, and they're probably wondering why this terrible sounding Australian man is walking with a phone following this strange dog coming towards their house. Finally, the wild Tato relents in his endless walk towards someone else's house. What do you have to say for yourself, Tato? Any defense at all? Let's go that way. You're going the wrong way, you mangy animal. No. That way. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Come on, Tato. Tato, come on. To home. You're just being a pain in my royal up diggity. I don't know what that means. I got nothing. I got nothing. But you're being a jerk. A big old jerk dog. Come on, Tito boy. Come on. <sighs> well, y'all think he's just a cute old dog, huh? Now you know he's an asshole. Tato, Tato, what do you have to say for yourself? Finally back here on your home turf. Anything to say for the viewers at home? Tato. Tato. You certainly are a majestic creature. Join us soon for more looks at the secret life of the wild Tato. Bum 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 b